What's going on guys? I'm Dan. This is Centered Waters. And before we keep on going, just like always, please hit that like button and subscribe and also hit that bell at the corner. Please. Thank you. So on today's episode of Scented Waters, I'm bringing to you a fragrance house called Alexandria Fragrances. On Alexandria Fragrances, I have not done that much research on them, but I think they're based out of California and the head guy is Hanny. So after watching a few reviewers reviews on Alexandria Fragrances, I figured I might as well make a few purchases myself and see what this house is about. Um, they have a whole list of um, fragrances, of inspirations, original creations, and the inspirations are actually of some high-end high houses like Creed, Tom Ford, um, and a whole bunch of other ones. So after chopping it up with Handy for a little bit, he actually was gracious enough to send me a few more extras on top of my purchase. Seems like a great guy. Now, by me saying all that, Yes, he sent me some stuff, but I am going to review it and there will be my own review. He's not paying me for any of this. He's not he, he's not sponsoring this. So this is just my own review, my mind, my nose. It's my opinion. So after saying all that, let's show you the ones I purchased. And after that, the ones that he sent me. So I purchased a few 38 mil bottles and one 60 mil bottle. Now the packages come in this cardboard box. Recessed inside the box looks pretty dope. Nice little decant bottle tall long stem a nice sprayer very nice sprayer so this is not going to be a review this is just going to be pretty much an unboxing first impressions i guess you can call that first impressions so for the first one is alexandria port which is i think uh inspiration of tom ford's neroli portofino sprayer is real good it smells really good it smells really good and i think it almost smells spot on close pretty I don't, I don't know the percentage yet. I'm gonna have to get a sample of the Neroli Portofino and see what that is. So another fragrance that I picked up from Alexandria Fragrances is called Citrus Splash, which I think is a, a take on Tom Ford's Mandarin D Amalfi. I think I'm saying it right, I'm not sure. Let's see, but it smells like a... Mm, smells really good. Has a very, a citrus, almost like a tangerine or a mandarin orange vibe to it. Hanny, I think you got something here, man. I don't know if I want to spend that money on them Tom Fords no more. <laughs> Hold on, man. So for my next one, I can tell you one thing, get these things out the box. You ain't got to worry about them falling out the box. So next fragrance that I purchased, which is another 30 mil bottle, is Crystal Peak, which from what it says on the website is their interpretation of Creed's Silver Mountain Water. Now, to be completely honest, I don't have much experience with Sil Creed Silver Mountain Water, but the smelling this so far, boy, boy, this is real nice, real nice. The last fragrance that I picked up was a 60 mil, came in this pouch, nice little pouch. And this one's called White Zest, which is their interpretation from Chanel Allure Edition Blanche. Another original that I have not smelled, but we're going off of this. Going off of this one, it has a nice, good citrus zest feeling to it. I'm gonna have to work with this one, but this one's another good one. Boy, Hanny, you're doing your thing, man. You're doing your thing. Now, when it comes to the two that he sent me, these bad boys right here. First on the chopping block of the ones that Hanny sent me is Wasted Moment is their interpretation of a Killian fragrance, which is a very expensive house. Too rich for my blood. So it's Creed, but let's digress. Um, uh, this one actually smells. Let me find somewhere to spray this real quick. <coughs> wow. Oh, that alcohol, boy. <clears throat> now, one thing that I'm noticing with these fragrances at the beginning, initial spray, they have a big burst of alcohol, which goes away fairly quickly, really quickly. But just to forewarn you, at the beginning, you're gonna get that burst. Don't don't let that turn you away. Now, with this, I can smell, wow, a really good apple brandy type smell. I'm gonna have to work with this one. This, this almost seems off, off top like a good date night fragrance or a bar 
maybe even club scene. I like it. It's off of first impression, but obviously I got to put it through the ringer. Next one that Handy sent me is actually from one of their original creations. It's called Cacao Dreams. And this one right here. Boy, what we got here? Cacao Dreams? Mmm. If you like chocolate, you're gonna like this. It's like a hot chocolate, like a dry, dry powdery chocolate, like Nesquik or even, let's just say some hot chocolate powder. All I know, this thing smells very delicious. I think my girl gonna wanna eat me up. Pause, you know what I mean. This thing smells real good, real delicious. It's a very gourmandy type fragrance. That cacao makes you want I almost wanted to take a bite out of myself because I'm almost that damn delicious. But you know, but Cacao Dreams is right about now. Very, very good, sweet, chocolatey scent. I like this. Of first impression, this is very nice. Annie, so far, so good. Now, obviously I gotta hit, put it through the ringer and hit it for that longevity, see what that compliment factor is. I'm gonna have to come back to y'all with that. But so far with Alexandria fragrances, out of the selections that I picked, and what I was sent, I'm liking them. So all these are gonna be pretty much my own opinions. I'm um, giving me about a few weeks and I'll come back to you with a final review on these things as a collective on how they've done. As of right now, I'm liking my options. And you know what, I'm gonna leave a link in the description area to their website so you can see what I'm talking about and see what you would like to try. Let me know in the comment section what piques your interest. So far, Cacao Dreams, White Zest, and Alexandria Port. They caught my attention, and so did the rest, don't get me wrong. But these so far, I'ma see what they about. At the end of the day, don't forget, they're still scented water.